My name is Katherine Welch. I'm the Managing Director of Sequence 46, and we're based in Los Angeles, California. Um, Sequence 46 is a pre-implantation genetic testing laboratory. We um, provide PGT for aneuploidy and also for structural rearrangements. Um, the biggest challenge is case evaluations um, to determine whether or not the unbalanced rearrangements can accurately be called on the NGS platform. In case of the large segments, it's a non-issue, um, but the true limits of the detection aren't yet known for the smaller rearrangements, and validation studies are difficult because there aren't re biorepositories that are dedicated to collecting the SR samples. We're relying on the software to determine whether or not we can detect breakpoints. We chose Ion Torrent because of a few reasons, but primarily because of the platform. So we really, really loved that there were 96 individual indices, 96 barcodes. It made the workflow very stre uh, streamlined, very easy to work with, and that has been great for our lab team. Um, additionally, I think that the software allows for a lot of customization, and um, we really love being able to change that as needed and, and you know, work through our validation to determine, really able to use the software to determine which cutoffs are best for us. So setting up our lab environment, we really didn't have too many things that we had to worry about. We have a very, very experienced team of technicians and um, we, building out from scratch, we're able to um, know what we needed to plan for to use the Ion Torrent platform. Um, we weren't switching over from an, another platform, so we had the space that we needed and um, everything fit in there perfectly. Yeah, so we've had excellent support from Thermo Fisher. Um, the team is always there. Um, you know, between the site prep guide and the IT and pre installation checklists, it, everything was very, very thorough and easy to set up. Um, I think that the Ion Torrent has allowed us to improve the workflow and thereby you know, our techs are much more productive. Um, we have a greater throughput with less people, um, with less cost, and I think that our end users are very happy with that. PGT has changed so much in the last five years, so I can only imagine where it's going to go in the next five years. Um, but, you know, we are seeing new things like PGT-M being more developed and um, obviously PGT-SR has already come a long way. So I think in the future we'll see um, a lot more come out of non-invasive um, chromosome screening and hopefully that'll be properly validated for clinical use. Um, and I think that'll lead to a lot more um, other potential opportunities for the technology.